<laughs> hey guys, <laughs> it's me and Jax, but you can't see him. I have a great story time for you guys. Uh, I'm actually really excited to tell you. It's kind of funny. It's kind of really funny. This was on my sister's birthday weekend, and we decided to go clubbing here in Hollywood. Not here. This, I'm not in Hollywood. Over there in Hollywood. <laughs> oh my god, it was so much fun. Okay, so let's start off with getting ready. So I'm going to show you guys a clip of like what we were all kind of wearing in like a group video just so you guys can get an idea. I'm the only one that's wearing pants and I wore this crop top and I didn't know if it was too cute or cute and then I asked my cousin and she told me I'd fit right in and I didn't know whether to take that as a compliment or as an insult but I was like, I'll take it. We're at my cousin's house, everybody's still getting ready, I'm the only one that's ready. And we leave, we're on our way, we're on the freeway, going to Hollywood, going to the club. So we get to the club and we're in the parking lot and we're in the car and my sister had bought two wine bottles, Stella Rosa, so good, and <laughs> they decided to chug those in the car so they can get a little, you know, a little bit tipsy while they're in the club because them drinks are really expensive. We're getting to the club. Let's start with the line. Okay, so there's a line for the 18 and over, right? And then there's a line for the 29, 21 and over. I'm not there yet, obviously. And I'm in line, and the line is huge for the 18 and over. And the one for the 21 and over, it isn't. And my cousins leave me with that, without even, like, giving two fluffs. So they just leave me, and I'm like, like this, in line. And then one of my cousins come back to the security guy and he has, he's like huge, he's like this tall guy. She goes to the guy and she's all like, excuse me, can my cousin come in the line with us? She's the only one that's uh, 18 and over. And the guy, he's like, yeah, yeah, go, 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 go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. And I'm like this, right? I'm like terrified because I'm alone. It's my first time clubbing, so I don't know what to expect. I'm like looking at him and I'm like, thank you. I guess he saw the fear in my eyes <laughs> because I was alone. So now I'm at the front of the line. <laughs> oh, God. And there's this other security guy, and he's checking everybody's IDs and whatnot. And I give him mine, and mine's obviously, like, vertical, not horizontal. So, you know. He's all like, how old are you? And I was like, uh, 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 18. I was like, no, wait. I'm 19. I'm 19. <laughs> and in the club, when you're underage, they put two X's on you so that they let people inside know that you're underage. And, you know, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm underage and he, and I was like no wait I'm 19 I was so intimidated by this guy he scared me and I was shaking he was like okay go and then my cousin the one that asked the security to let me in with them she's next to me and he's like how old are you and my cousin's like uh 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 25 uh 25 was, she's shaking with her with her ID and she's like uh uh I'm 25 <laughs> and this guy is so intimidating. He's tall as hell. He's bald. He's huge. And oh my god, he's just so intimidating. I. What the Whoopee! I'm in the middle of the story time. Okay, so me and my cousin start walking into the club, and we're just laughing because of that guy that was just incredibly intimidating and scary as hell. So <laughs> we're laughing it off. We get inside and. What the is it? The music is playing, our bodies are swaying, you know what I'm saying. You wanna do that? <laughs> so the music is like amaze balls, right? So we walk toward the bar because my cousins want to get a drink, and since it's my sister's birthday on that day, it was a Saturday, it was on a Saturday. They were, <clears throat> they were getting her a drink for her birthday and you know it was it was pumping like that club was pumping i'll put a i'm gonna put a couple like a clip so you guys know how pumping it is you know okay <laughs> dancing and I decide to show my cousins my signature move in the club even though they told me that I wouldn't do it but I told them I was gonna do it cuz I'm just that dedicated I'm gonna show you what it is I didn't know this but there was a security guard behind me I, I did I didn't know and I did this 
I get down low and then I, like I said, I didn't know the security guard was behind me, but my cousin, when I was done doing my move, my cousin had told me that the guy saw me do that and he was like, like he was like, what's going on? Like, what is this girl doing? And I'm just like, I had no idea. But I don't care. My cousins and I are on the dance floor, right? We're having like so much fun. And we had this thing, like if there was a guy that came up to one of us and we just did not want to deal with him, we would have to like, like somehow grab each other's arms to let them know that there's this guy that's like bugging us. We had this whole like pl thing planned out like to take care of each other. And we definitely stuck to it. My cousin Erica, she's so funny. Hey, boo. <laughs> okay, she's definitely gonna see this. She, I, I showed her, I, I told her what happened to her oh when we got there. I showed her and everything, and now I'm gonna show you guys. <laughs> my cousin Erica, she's a very voluptuous, plus size woman. She's very gorgeous, so beautiful. And she, you know, she got that big booty. <laughs> yeah, she was wearing this really cute skirt, you know. Mm, she looked fire. And <laughs> she's dancing, you know, minding her own business. And this guy comes up behind her, <laughs> starts to do the red nose dance on her. <laughs> I'm trying to signal her and she's not paying attention to me. So I was like, what do I do? Do I just let him do his thing? Cause he's not, <laughs> he's not really like behind her. Okay, this is her. The guy was probably like over here doing it to her. Like he wasn't that close to her. He was like way over here, but I could still see him doing it. Uh, I'm gonna do a, a little demonstration for you guys right about now. He literally gets low, he does this, and he goes in there. And then when he's done, he high fives his friend and they're just laughing it off. It was so freaking funny. I also left that part out, my bad. <laughs> yeah, he was doing that to her and I didn't know what to do. Like I was like, Erica, and she's just like, with her drink in her hand, minding her own business. And I looked at my cousins and I was like, I didn't know what to do. And this guy is just, just like going ham in there. And it is, it's so incredibly funny. And I when, when I showed my cousin, she was dying. She was laughing. Oh my God, it was super, super funny. Every couple of minutes or whatever, there'd be guys behind us trying to dance with us, you know, trying to get up in there, but you know, us being classy ladies, we will not let them. <laughs> we would have this thing, like if there was a guy behind us trying to like dance, uh, we would like grab each other's arms and pull each other forward and like kind of switch positions or move each other to a different area so that they wouldn't be behind us. We had this whole system going, like I said. That happened quite often. <laughs> Okay, so three of us go outside. My cousin Erica and my cousin Jackie, we decided to go outside to like cool down a little bit. And then they start playing this my jam, my, my Latina jam, Suavemente. Mm. If y'all don't know that, I'll play it right here. That is the jam. And you know, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling the music. I'm like dancing all by myself while we're, while we're outside. Oh, I just totally kicked him in the face. My bad. Sorry, honey. And this guy comes up behind me and then he's like, and I look at him and I'm like, why not? <laughs> I start dancing with him like, like this, how you know you would normally dance with someone like that. And you know, I'm going ham, I'm twirling myself <laughs> and I'm having fun. And then when I'm, I'm done with it, like I, I'm over it, I was like, okay, bye, I'm good. <laughs> And this guy kept insisting. He's like, he's like, no, come on, let's dance. And I was like, no, 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 I'm good. Thank you. And he kept insisting. He's like, no, come on, let's dance. And I'm like, no, it's okay. I'm tired. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm resting. Let me rest. And then he decides to grab me. Hold on, I'll show you how he grabbed me. Everybody, this is my pillow pet, Ronnie. <laughs> So he, I, we're literally like this. He has me like this and I'm, I'm like this cause he's grabbing me like this. That's totally, that makes sense. <laughs> and he's all like, look at my face. And I was like, okay, look at my face. And I'm gonna look at your face. Remember it because for the next song, I'm gonna come find you so we can dance. I was like, okay, bye. <laughs> and then he's like, are you, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna dance, right? And I was like, yeah, okay, bye. 
like still like this he's still holding on to me and I'm like this and I'm like okay bye and I'm just like looking at my cousin like Whoa, but she's not helping me <laughs> and I'm just like okay bye <laughs> and then I was like should I not have done that <laughs> this guy I don't know what his problem was but he just you do not put your hands on me like that my cousins were like dude <laughs> And I was like, what? He offered to dance. And I was like, why not? Memories. <laughs> Even though he did turn out to be a little creepy in the end. But that's okay. Story time. My cousin Jackie and I went to go outside again to sit down and chill for a little bit. And this guy comes up to us with a drink in his hand. And he offers it to us. And he's like, would you like a drink? Would you like a drink? We're like, no, we're good, thanks. And he's like, Captain Sydney, he's like, come on. just you're, you're thirsty. Come on, take a drink. And we're like, no, thanks. We're good. And then my cousin and I decided to just watch him in that little like patio area in the outside. I don't, I don't know what it is. And we're just watching him and he does not take a single drink out of that cup. We just watch him the entire time. And then when he comes back, he offers us again, would you like a drink? Come on, I know you're thirsty. And we're like, no thanks, we're good. And the cup is still at the same level at where it was in the, from the beginning when he asked us the first time. It had not like lowered at all. The same. I don't know what the. Mm -mm. Ah, no, thank you. Don't accept drinks from strangers, ladies and gentlemen. PSA. I did not see this happen, but my sister and my cousin Erica did, and they told the story of a guy and a girl meeting for the first time in the club. <laughs> And they decided to grind all up in each other. And did they kiss? Yeah, they started making out. He started making out. <laughs> From what I heard, I guess the guy started... Uh... How do I put this in a very PG-13 way? <laughs> okay, so basically what this guy did to her is that he... Uh... He had his hand in her hoo-ha. Yeah. What? Like, why... Why in a club, pe public, why, people just there, why? I don't understand as to why would she let him do that and why would he do that to her? Like, that shit's so gross. Like, girl, you don't know where those hands have been and dude, you don't know where she's been. Like, come on guys, be a little, have a little, be a little classy. That's what I'm trying to say, okay? Don't be trashy. I'm just, I'm glad my innocent little eyes <laughs> did not see that at all. I have no mental picture of it either, so I'm in the clear. <laughs> a couple of my cousins and I are outside. We're relaxing once again, cause it's way too hot inside. And my sister and my cousin Erica go inside and they dance. They're like at the very front where the DJ is. And apparently somebody started throwing cash to them. To the girls dancing apparently. On the stage. On the stage. And I got a dollar, dollar she bill. got some dollar bills. How many did you get? You got $2, huh? Dude, Erica, got four Erica got $4 and she got $2. Hey, that's still something, you know? Okay, so I might have left probably one of my favorite parts of the night out accidentally. Oops, I totally forgot. Um, but all of my cousins were outside except for my cousin Erica and my sister. They were inside. Um, and this guy comes up to me. He's all like, I just had to come up to you. you you're just so beautiful. <laughs> And of course, my reaction, you know, it's probably perfect. <laughs> I was like, I know. Like, I was flipping my hair. He's like, you're so beautiful. I just had to come up and talk to you. He's like, you're so beautiful. And I was like, I know. Let me just say, I wasn't being conceited or rude. I was just feeling myself. You guys, you have no idea how good I felt that night. Like, I felt so freaking confident. More than I have ever felt ever. Like, that specific night i don't know why my makeup was on point my hair was on point my outfit was on point i was feeling myself so there's nothing wrong with saying i know but don't worry after that i did say thank you <laughs> after i said like i know and flipping my hair and everything he looked at me like he looked at me like bitch you conceited ass hoe like, no i'm not it's just like i said i was feeling myself so <laughs> It was probably the best part ever, you know. <laughs> and then we were about to leave and I go tell my cousin Jackie, she's outside. She wanted to relax. She was getting really hot in there. It's really, really hot, you guys. You have no idea how hot it was inside there. 
So she's outside, and, like, the rest of us just kept dancing for, like, one last time. And uh, they told me that we were leaving. I was like, okay, I'll go tell Jackie. So I go, and I tell her, and I'm standing up, right? She's, like, right in front of me, and I'm standing up. And all of a sudden, this guy has the audacity to grab my booty. Oh, my God, he grabbed the left cheek. Like, not a full, just like a little, like, something that you can feel and something you can definitely tell if somebody was grabbing your ass. It wasn't somebody, like, passing by accidentally, like, touched your butt. No. I can feel his fingers do this. And I'm like, whoa. And I turn back and this guy is gone. I'm like, what the heck? And I'm freaking out. I'm telling my cousin, I'm like, this guy just grabbed my ass. And I'm freaking out. Like, who the hell grabbed my ass? I'm like mad. I want, I'll, I tell you, I was about to swing back. But when I turned like that, the guy was already gone. And I had no idea who it was. And all I can see were these like group of guys just staring at me like, like, they saw what happened. They are like, ooh, he just grabbed her ass and now she's pissed. Like, they were just like, and I'm like going crazy. I'm telling my cousins and then they're like, no, let's go. So we're leaving and like, it was a good time and I'm dancing. And then my cousins are like, dance on your way, dance on your way out. So we do dancing on my way out and snot and snot and stuff. <laughs> you know, just one last time. And we get to the front, we get outside. It's so fresh outside and the security guys are all like okay ladies be safe have a nice time blah 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 hope you had a nice time whatever being nice <laughs> and then this one of the security guy the security guy from the beginning the one that let me in he's like hey i just hope you i'm just glad you guys didn't end up like her and this girl is like blacked out drunk she's short ass dress and she's on a chair like on the seat like this like knocked out and was her throw up on the floor i couldn't see I don't know if there was throw up on the floor, but she was like knocked out. And then the guy was like, I'm just glad you guys didn't end up like her. And my cousin, she was like, what? That's goals. And <laughs> you guys, uh, in a way, I kind of wish I would have gotten a video of that girl, but it's like kind of mean, but you know, it was pretty funny. She was just like, shit you not. <laughs> we're leaving and we're in the car and the parking lot, is directly in front of where David Dobrik lives. Like, directly in front. Everybody knows where David Dobrik lives. <laughs> you know, my, one of my cousins and I go crazy because we he's just freaking amazing. <laughs> and my sister, we go crazy because he's so freaking hilarious. I love his vlog. David, I love you. <laughs> we drive in front of, like, the balconies, like, the building. We drive in front of the building, and we do this. Let's go find his Tesla. Where's David? He's not in there! No. That's fun. Yeah, no, we did that. <laughs> that is it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. And if you did, please give it a nice big old thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel for weekly videos. Have a nice day and a great week. And I will see you guys next time. Bye! And scene! <laughs>